Hey everyone, my name is Riley and this video is a complete tutorial on Holofly. I'm going to walk you through the entire process showing you which phones are compatible with eSIMs and then I will take you over the shoulder step by step and show you how we can purchase and install a Holofly SIM onto your phone. So to kick things off, let's first of all take a look at which phones are actually compatible with Holofly because not all of them are. In terms of iPhones, we are looking at anything iPhone XS and above. So the iPhone XS, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15, and then anything from there, anything newer that comes out, these are all compatible with Holofly. In terms of Android, there are just way too many different Android phones. So what I will do is I will put a link in the description of this video where you can go to the specific brand that you have and check if your model of device is listed on there. If it is, then it is compatible. So definitely make sure to go ahead and check that out before you actually buy the eSIM for your phone. And then once you are sure that your phone is compatible, let's now jump in and take a look how to buy and install an eSIM with Holofly. To access Holofly, you can get the best deals and discounts by using the top link in the description. Once you click on that link, it's going to take you to this website right here, which is Holofly. So on Holofly, we can now go down and we can see all of the different SIM cards that we can buy for all of these different destinations. So we can click view all destinations right here, and you may need different SIM cards depending on the purpose of your travel. So for example, if we are just traveling to one specific country, if we are traveling to Spain, then we can go to this top search bar and we can search for Spain right here. So I'm going to go down and click on to Spain. And then we can see this is the travel plan for Spain. So we can choose the number of days that we are going for. Let's say I'm going for a week right here. Then we can see the price of the eSIM. We can also go up here to this currency button. And if I want to change this, for example, to US dollars, then we can flick that across. And once again, I'll just select the day that we are going on just like that. And then we can see the price right here. So that is if you are going for individual destinations. However, you might be traveling across various countries. Let's say we are traveling across Europe and I need data in Spain, Germany, and Italy. Well, it's going to be very, very expensive to buy individual data plans for each of these. So instead, what we can do if we back out is in the search bar, we can search for Europe. So if we search Europe right here, we can see Europe. And then if we go over to the technical specs right here, we can scroll down and we can see all of the countries that this data is available in. So with this European SIM card, this is going to give me data in all of these countries right here. So I said Spain, Germany, and Italy. So we have Germany right here. We have Italy right here. And we also have Spain right here. So perfect. This SIM card is going to work. So just make sure that if you are buying one of these European SIM cards or any other continent, that the countries you are traveling to are actually mentioned here. So those are the different types of SIM cards that you can get. So for example, what I will do is I will go into Spain right here. Then we can buy a Spanish SIM card. So I'll go down. I'll just go for one as this is an example. Then we can click on get unlimited internet. And this is now going to take us over to the checkout area. So we just click on checkout when we have this SIM card in the basket. And from here, we can now choose the payment method that we want to pay with. So I'm going to select Apple Pay right here, and then we can pay for this. The order is now being processed. And just like that, this order is now confirmed. So what we can now do is back out of the website. And if we go over to the email, you can see the eSIM is now ready. And what we need to do is actually install the SIM card manually from this email. So all you need to do is back out of this and go into your device settings and then go down to the mobile data option on your phone. This will be the same for iPhone and Android. Find like the mobile data section and click into that. Then we can click on add an eSIM right here and it will take a few seconds to load in. And then from these options, click on use QR code, then enter details manually. And in here, this is going to ask us to enter in the information. So we can go back out and then right at the bottom here, we are going to see all of this information. So we just copy this right here, copy, and then we can paste this in. Then the activation code, we can paste this in as well. And then for the confirmation code at the bottom, it says not required. So we can paste that, click on enter. And this SIM is now going to go through and get activated. So perfect, we can now click on continue. And the setup is now complete. 
So we can click on done right here. And then you should be able to see under sims, we have a primary sim. This is your main mobile number. And we also have a secondary sim, which is the sim that we just installed. So what I always do is I will turn this off where it says turn on this line. Turn this off until I get to my destination. Then I will turn this one off, the one that we just bought. Turn the primary phone number off. And that way you will be only using the data from the plan that we just bought. So that is how you can buy and install a sim using Holofly. If you found this video valuable, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy.